This video covers um, some of the problems that are associated with applying a Campanello 11 speed cog and freewheel to an Easton R4 hub. Now the Easton literature says that the R4 hub with the right freewheel is compatible with the Super Record, Record and Chorus um, um, 11 speed uh, products. However, there's been reports on the internet that these things are failing prematurely and I found that I had some spacing problems when I went to uh, put this package together. So this video kind of goes over what I had to do in order to get this thing to work a little bit better. Uh, first of all, the Campy uh, record and chorus um, cogs here, or uh, yeah, gears, are actually stamped and there's a bit of an angle here where this angle as it comes down and how those are stamped actually interferes with the uh, Easton uh, freewheel. So what I had to do was actually file off some material in each one of these areas here to accommodate and allow the gear to actually sit flat against the, um, the uh, cassette. The second area that uh, I noticed was on the front side here, if you just go ahead and put the nut in, there's not nearly enough clearance here to get the frame, even with that pushed back, to get this uh, where the, the face of the uh, uh, Campanello lock ring isn't going to interfere with your frame. So what I did there was actually manufactured, using some copper wire, a washer I just bent the copper around a cylindrical part and then soldered it and then flattened it out to the thickness that I wanted. And this then gets applied down inside of the hub here. And so when the whole package is put together onto the wheel, what you end up with is a part that still is able to spin freely. And when you go ahead and apply your nut, what you'll end up with is enough clearance to clear the frame. So both of the areas are addressed in that you're not putting stress onto the freewheel body anymore and you have the right clearance here to go into your frame. Uh, I found that this worked quite sufficiently and I hope it helps you if you are running into similar problems trying to use the combination of an Acampi 11 speed onto an Easton R4 hub.